Welcome to a podcast unfolding the life transforming power of the scripture. VJ Travin Academy presents Celebrate Christ with Viju Jeremiah Travin. Stay tuned for Bible recitals, songs, reflections, discussions, intercession, adoration and more. Be blessed. Welcome to VJ Travin podcast episode 8. we are going to discuss how yeshua is the savior of the fallen humanity i feel like singing every knee shall bow every tongue confess that of jesus christ is the lord every knee shall bow every tongue confess that of jesus christ is the lord he is lord he as a son from the dead and he is lord every knee shall bow every tongue confess that a jesus christ is the lord yes yeshua is the savior of the fallen humanity the father of glory in his infinite wisdom chose to send his only begotten son on earth to herald the year of favor to fallen humanity the year of favor to fallen humanity happened when yeshua manifested on earth in through his virgin birth so this is what we need to know without holding is equality with god the son of god humbly submitted to his father's plan for our salvation philippians 2:6 john 3:16 as a consequence 2000 years ago Gabriel the archangel appeared to the highly favored virgin called Mary this young Jewish woman from Nazareth a Galilee settlement in Israel was betrothed to Joseph an Abrahamic descendant Gabriel brought the good news of great joy regarding the redemption of the world defiled by the deception of sin he greeted and told mary that tr- the triune god was with her concerning the incarnation of the messiah the abba chose mary to give birth to his son in the flesh without human intervention Gabriel also revealed that the son would be called Yeshua because he would rescue his people from their sins Mary accepted the spoken word sent from heaven as the seed of god to conceive the savior of the world as the as the offspring of the virgin's womb matthew chapter 1 23 she believed nothing was impossible for god She believed nothing was impossible for God. Hence the shadow of almighty came upon her and she became impregnated by the holy spirit. Later she birthed 
Thus the Virgin Mary became Mother Mary, the blessed woman of all women. Luke chapter 1, 42. The wise men of the East observed a rising star lighting up the sky and they recognized the birth of the King of the Jews. They traveled to Bethlehem in the direction of the star where they adore the newborn king of kings and presented gifts. The radiant morning star of heaven brought grace and truth to liberate us from the bondage of corruption. John 117, 2 Peter 2, 19, Revelation 22 and 16. His word of life enlightens our inner man to co-build his kingdom of light and demolish the works of darkness. Christ created humanity in his image and likeness. So redemption was only possible through his atonement. Genesis chapter 1, 27 and 3, 15. The Lamb of God was slain even before the foundation of the world to accomplish that purpose. First Peter. First chapter, 19 to 20, Revelation 13, 8. He manifested to rescue the sinners who are powerless to save themselves from the wrath of God. Romans 5, 6, John 1, 14. The first step in the working out of the salvation that God has gifted us through His Son is to confess our faith in Yeshua and accept Him as the Lord, as our Lord and King. Holy Bible tells us there is no one righteous, not even one. No other name under heaven has been given to man by God through which we might be saved from the penalty of our sins. Acts chapter 4, 12. Therefore, every knee shall bow and every tongue confess, every tongue will confess that Jesus Christ is the only Lord and Savior. Romans 3, 10. Philippians 2.10 So every knee shall bow Every tongue confess That Jesus Christ is the Lord 